And we continue our team coverage with a check around the area, and it's been something we've seen all week. The tides rising higher than usual. It's caused trouble in parts of Norfolk, but for many communities, the worst may be yet to come. Many of your size, Jason Marks, live in The Hague now with preparations for some big flooding this weekend. Jason. Tom, you know what? We haven't seen the wind or the rain like other areas, but we have definitely seen the rising water. You can see it all around me. And take a look at a good example here. Did a little experiment. That first stake you see there, I put in the ground at 5 o'clock. The second one is at 5.30, and you can see how much the water has advanced past these two stakes, and it continues to rise now towards the grass. Uh, here at The Hague, one of those typical areas, we have many of them around here in Norfolk and in Portsmouth where it always floods whenever we have a storm like this. Now I can tell you here in the city of Norfolk, crews for the last two days, three days, have been clearing out ditches and storm drains, getting all of that debris out, making sure that they don't have the flooding uh, or making sure that it's not going to be worse than what we expect. Obviously, a big thing here for concern is property damage, whether it's homes or cars. Uh, I can tell you that people typically tend to drive through the water whenever we have uh, storms like this. Obviously not a good thing, and Norfolk officials are urging you, if you see water, just drive the other way. But you could very well stall your engine. Uh, you could get stuck in a flooded area, and, and you know, you'll have to wait a while for the water to come down to, to get out. Plus, I mean, it's a, it's a financial burden, too, because if you do impact your vehicle, uh, it, it costs a lot to replace your engine versus taking some additional time to, to find alternate routes. Yeah, always good to go somewhere else. I want to show you one quick thing before we send it back to you guys. I've been here since uh, about 3 o'clock, been measuring this since about 4. At 4 o'clock, the water level here at this, uh, this, this uh, ditch around uh, the Hague was at 3 inches. We're now at 20 inches, so it's obviously coming up. I can tell you that here in the city of Norfolk, they've opened up parking garages, some of the city garages, also some of the school lots. So if you have a car that you think that needs to be moved to higher ground, just go to wavy.com and we have a list of those garages and parking lots for you. That way you don't have to worry about your car getting damaged over the next two days. That's it for here in Norfolk. Jason Marks now back to you guys.